Hi there, this is Tom from Create eCards. Did you know AI has made incredible strides in design generation? Using tools like ChatGPT, you can create stunning invitation designs or explore Google's Gemini with their new Imogen 4 capabilities. However, creating just the invitation image might not be enough. You may want to send it out as an online invitation and collect RSVPs. And that's precisely what this video is all about. Let's dive into it here. I am on createecards.io slash AI, and this is where you'll start. We've put together some prompts and templates that open up in ChatGPT, guiding you to generate your invitation design. Then you can return to create eCards to create an online invitation page for sending and collecting RSVPs. Let's get started by clicking on Create Your Invitation. Now we're entering a ChatGPT experience. What's the title of your event? Let's say it's Tom's 43rd Cocktail Party. Let's keep it elegant. Let's pretend it's happening today, so we'll set the date to Friday, 13th of June, 2025. You can, of course, use any format you like. You're just having a conversation with ChatGPT. Let's say the venue is a bar at 123 Annie Street, anywhere, any town. We're just putting a placeholder for now. Now what theme should we choose? We can select from several options since ChatGPT understands our context. We're going for a tropical cocktail lounge vibe, I like that idea. Great, I'm going to upload a photo of myself just copy and paste it into ChatGPT. That's fantastic because we'll try to incorporate my image into the design. Let's choose one of the options. You could add more text or specify colors and vibes you want. Let's go ahead and make the design a bit surreal, perhaps cartoon-like. I'll go with that since I'm not after a realistic scene. ChatGPT is generating the invitation image now. It'll take a moment. And there it is. We're nearly there. This workflow is set to create a portrait style invitation perfect for online sharing. We'll continue the experience shortly. Just waiting a bit. Oh, I like how it's coming together. This is pretty cool. It resembles me and says Tom's 43rd. AI sometimes struggles with text accuracy in images and it hasn't perfectly captured cocktail party, but all other details are correct. We could re-prompt to fix the text, but I'll proceed to the next step instead. Alright, moving on, let's go to the next step. Okay, so now it's guiding me on the next steps. Download the image, upload it into a Canva template, and use the Create eCards app in Canva to turn this design into an online invitation. Here's a tip, you don't need to download the image, just right-click and copy it. Next, I'm opening the Canva template to use for a new design. There are some simple instructions. Remember, don't upload anything that could infringe on copyright. ChatGPT might generate content that's copyrighted, which shouldn't be used in your invitations or uploaded to Canva. So we've downloaded the invite from ChatGPT. Now let's upload it to Canva. I've copied it into memory, so I'm just pasting it here and onto the page too, so I can still see the instructions. Now I'll set it as the background image in Canva. Our invitation is now in Canva and I'll delete this page. In step four, we'll visit apps, search for Create eCards and open the Create eCards app. You're in for a treat. We're loading our newest app, which isn't fully available yet, but the current app offers a similar experience. Now, what's next? We'll hit Sync Design to create an online invitation. Exporting our invite design to Create eCards turns it into a web page with RSVP functionality. Your online invitation is starting to take shape. The next step, let's save time using Magic Fill, a fantastic free AI feature on Create eCards website. Magic Fill analyzes the design and builds an online invitation page that matches its style. It extracts as much detail as possible, creating a nearly complete online invitation. We'll need to fill out the time and location details since we used placeholders earlier. Let's continue. Tom's 43rd cocktail party is now set in Australia, specifically Sydney. Let's schedule it for the 30th of June at 4.30pm. 
Wow, that's coming up soon. You can customize your invitation with details like location and even turn gifting on or off. I'll turn gifting off. There are various settings for guests and our other videos provide more on setting up your invitation. I'm just skimming it quickly in this vid. We can edit additional information. The invitation is almost ready. I'll tweak the styling by changing the banner shadows to match the invite. I'll also adjust the button shadow and make it a round button. I like the look of round buttons. Next, let's publish the invite. You can personalize the invitation's URL. I'll quickly do that. I'll just add 13th June. You can use any URL and dashes are automatically added if needed. Hitting publish will make it live. Here's the online invitation page. You can now send it to guests, allowing them to RSVP. Thanks for watching. Visit createcards.io slash AI to begin your journey with our online AI invitation maker and check out more of our videos for tips on sending invitations and collecting RSVPs. This was just a quick overview, so thank you.